All right, so let me start off by saying I'm not going all Farrah Fawcett on you guys. I curled my hair, I'm letting it sit before I go out tonight, and I decided to sit down and do this video, so I'm still just letting it sit. So, start out with that. Um, I'm first gonna show you guys what I packed with me the last time I went to the Cape, and then I'm gonna show you what I'm packing this time. So, I just got out of the shower, but I wanted to sit down and show you guys before I unpacked my hair is still wet, like all I did was my makeup, I don't even have any jewelry on or anything yet. I just have on a t-shirt and shorts, but I wanted to show you guys what I packed when I went to the Cape the first time, and then later on I'm going to show you when I do pack. It's the first time I always overpack, and I always pack incorrectly, and then I remember what I do and don't need. I tend to take just a big old bag from Sigma. What, this one is from like way back in the day. They don't make it anymore. If anyone knows of a really big, just open bag that would be good for makeup, I would love to hear about it because this one's kind of falling apart. Like it's got thing, it's broke, it's just breaking. And I just really want another one. I'd love something that's in a bright color because it's always easy to find. Um, so I always overpack. And so I'm going to show you now and then I'll show you again. First thing I always take is my brush roll. If you guys want to dedicate a video to my brush roll, let me know. Um, there's one brush that isn't in there. There it is. I took this one. I've been using it for my Peter Thomas Roth, the Sedona Lace 480. I don't know a whole lot about it. And then this one was not in there either. It's the Vita Liberta little one. Um, but this is my brush roll. It's so dirty it needs to go in the laundry. Um, I don't have much makeup on today at all, but let's start pulling some things out. All right, the Vita Liberta bronzer. That's what I have on today. Love it. Um, I, I just love the natural bronze, healthy glow it gives you. Um, Lancome waterproof concealer. Uh, Tarte CC corrector. I'm not going to do close-ups of these. I'm just running through all this. Laura Mercier smooth finish powder in number three. I'm getting towards the end of that. I do have a backup. Somebody told me they're discontinuing that. Urban Decay Naked Skin Ultra Definition Powder. I'll put links below, but as I said, I'm not going to do close-ups. I hit pan on this, and this is my favorite powder. I use this way. Um, Too Faced Semi-Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette. Probably didn't need to take that. Um, I got this while I was there. The L'Oreal La Palette Nude Number 1. It is the, I think it's the bronze one, I think it is. I've only used it twice. Um, not bad. So I picked that up, so I kind of got added in. Hourglass Bronzer in ambi the Ambient Lighting in Luminous Bronze Light. Uh, MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Stereo Rose. Uh, it's limited edition, but they've had it out a bunch of times. That is a go-to for summer for me. Of course, I don't have it on right now. Tarte Amazonian Clay smooth Smoothing Balm in Light Medium. That's that, like, BB Balm like that a lot. That's a lot of fun. Uh, Laura Mercier Highlighter in 01. The Baked One. Matte Baked Highlighter. My Sephora Mirror. Now, a lot of people always ask me where I got these. These are just ceramic coasters like for drinks. Um, and I, when I travel, I use one of those Sephora mirrors. You know how you get those like if you get a gift card? You can see I used it. I have to clean it now. But like how easy is that if you're traveling? Just a thought. Becca Ombre Nude Palette. My Trish McAvoy Palette that has in it, on this side it has a couple, uh, I think those are all MAC shadows. They are all MAC shadows. And then on the bottom of this, I have the bigger ones are Trish McAvoy and the smaller ones are Mary Kay shadows. And they're just, I can always do an easy look with that. Bare Minerals Top Shelf Duo, wore that the other day. The NARS Duo in Isolad. I guess I should probably show this to you, huh? Okay, maybe that, that's Top Shelf. This is the NARS Duo in Isolad. I love this for summertime. Most amazing summer eye with that. Um, all right, Too Faced Melted Liquefied Long Wear Lipstick in Melted Nude. Uh, the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place Eyeliner in Sapphire. That's a lot to say. NARS uh, Radiant Creamy Concealer in Honey, I think. Yes, Honey. MAC Lip Liner in Cedar because I had planned on doing a red lip and I didn't. Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. I took number five with me. Um, the Shiseido Sun UV Protective Liquid Foundation in Medium Beige and Light Beige. I have to mix these two together now. 
one color doesn't work for me anymore on those. Peter Thomas Roth CC Cream. Um, love this stuff. This is what I have on today. And I only have on light to medium today, but I also have medium to tan, and I mix that in sometimes if I need it. And it is just awesome. Uh, Bare Minerals Buxom Lip Gloss in White Russian. NARS Satin Lip Pencil in the Rikugan. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. I always like that one. Uh, Laura Mercier Paint Wash in Nude Rose, which is what I have on my lips right now. The Lancome Rouge and Love Lipstick. I have no idea what this color is. I think it says 230M, but I'm not sure. It actually is really pretty in the summertime. It looks really bright on there, but it's a cool bright coral. Benefit Gimme Brow. Marc Jacobs Highliner in the black and the brown. Uh, Makeup Forever 1, 2, and 3C Lip Liners. NARS Pro Prime. Kat Von D Tattoo Liner. I always call this the wrong thing. Just a sample size. Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. It's almost at the end. Clinique Colourpop Blush in Melon Pop. Guerlain Terracotta July Tint uh, Beautifying Foundation with Sunscreen in Light. Marc Jacobs the VIB Rouge Red. That's what I was going to wear with the Cedar Lipstick. Didn't end up wearing it. Clinique Colourpop in Bear Pop. Makeup Forever Blush Cream in 220. And I think that's everything. There's a comb and some hair ties in here. Some, and that is everything. I take a little towel with me as well, and I take a little mirror that has regular close and far, just in case while I'm doing my makeup, I feel like I need to get closer. I always have that with me. And that is everything I took with me this time. I would scale that down. I would only take certain eyeshadows, but I will do another video on that when I pack to go the next time. And uh, you guys will see that. So thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Oh, what's on my face? What I'm wearing. Um, what I'm wearing is CC Corrector, Urban Decay Naked Powder, Vita Liberta Bronzer. Blush is Hourglass Ambient Lighting Blush in Dim Infusion. Anastasia. Oh, I have my Anastasia Brow Wiz with me. I had put that away. That had gone with me too. I use this all the time. Um, Anastasia Brow Wiz in Soft Brown. Um, oh, this is with me too. Benefit Roller Lash. Uh, I have this on right now too, and the paint wash. That's everything. Oh, under my eyes. What do I have? Oh, I have uh, the land. No, I didn't use the chart today because it was in my thing. Uh, the Bobby Brown tinted eye Bobby Brown tinted eye brightener is under my eyes, and the Lancome waterproof concealer is under my eyes as well. That is everything. So um, I will see you guys when I pack next time. All right, so on to this time, start with the same bag. I pack my little mirror that I use um, for mixing foundations on. It's just the Sephora mirror, you know, that they give to you. And I'm just kind of winging it. I'm gonna open my drawers and show you as it comes. Take my brush roll with me. Um, I am going to take the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk in 5.5. I'm going to take the Peter Thomas Roth in both light, medium, and medium to tan. You're not going to see close-ups in this video, too. I am going to take the Shiseido Sun Protection Foundation in light beige and medium beige. I am going to take my Guerlain Perfection in 2 and 3. And my July Terracotta July Tint in light and natural. Natural never works for me, but you never know. Under eyes, I am going to take the Tarte CC Corrector. You might see MJ running around back there. He's playing. Um, I am going to take, I'm just going just drawer by drawer, Laura Mercier Cream Contour Set. I'm going to take the Hourglass Bronzer and the Vita Liberta Bronzer and the brush that goes with the Vita Liberta Bronzer. Powders, Laura Mercier Smooth Powder, number three, Urban Decay Naked Powder, Chanel Loose Powder. This is going to take up a lot of space but it is what it is. Shiseido Sun Protection Powder. This one, actually, I need to get the refill on before I put that in there. I have a refill for that, too. Um, concealers. La uh, Lancome Waterproof Concealer, one of my all-time favorites. NARS Creamy Concealer. Mm, I'm going to take the Dior Star because I've been playing with that a little bit again. 
blushes. I'm going to take the Makeup Forever HD Cream Blush. I am going to take NARS Orgasm, NARS Madly, and NARS Outlaw. I should probably just take my NARS palette instead. Ooh, but that hourglass one. Ugh, I don't need it. I don't need it with me. Alrighty. I'm just kind of running with what I have. On to shadows. Bronze Goddess. I'm going to take that one. I'm going to take my Trish McAvoy palette that has a bunch of different things in it. And in the top, I'm going to add my Urban Decay Easy Baked. I'll do that in a minute. Let me set that there. I'll do that in a minute. I'm going to take my MAC palette. That's just my everyday one. I'll shake this stuff to the side. My Benefit Gimme Brow, Anastasia Brow Wiz in Caramel and Soft Brown, my little water holder, which probably needs water in it. Um, I'm going to take the Laura Mercier Pan Liner in Black, uh, NARS Pro Primer, ooh, I want this, uh, NARS Duo, the Isolade Duo, love that one for summertime. I'm going to take the Estee Lauder Little Black Primer just in case I have any issues with my lash extensions, which these ones I don't usually, but and you guys are probably seeing this video way after I actually am at the Cape because I got to tape it, edit it and all that. Okay. Lip liners, makeup forever one, two, and three C. If I take those three with me, they usually do the gamut and I'm good to go. Uh, pencil liners. Let's see here. My three of choice are the two Marc Jacobs Genius Gels, I think they're called, no, Highliners in the brown and black, and the Estee Lauder Double Wear in the blue. Too Faced Melted Lipstick in Nude, Laura Mercier Paint Wash in Nude Rose, NARS Satin Lip Pencil in Rikugan, I think is how you say that, but I am not positive on that. Um, lip Gloss, Buxom Lip Gloss in White Russian. I'm filling it up, guys. Sorry, I'm reaching over here. Uh, Clinique Bear Pop. This, where did my Victoria's Secret one go? Sorry, I'm gonna find that one. Um, Lancome lipstick, the Rouge in Love in the number 220M. There's a Victoria's Secret lipstick I like somewhere here. I don't know, I'll find it. I'm gonna take Hourglass Whisper and NARS, what is this? No, Barbara isn't the one I want, no. I want the one, where did I go? This is the one I want, Anna. Take that, uh, don't need an eyelash curler. Do I need any other, oh, Makeup Forever Lab Shine in S2. No, you know what, I'm not gonna take that, I will take this. My YSL Gloss Stain in number six. Oh, in case I want to do a red lip. I need my red lip liner too. Um, this is the Marc Jacobs like sample lipstick and I need Mac Cedar. There it is. Mac lip liner and cedar. Is that everything? Highlighter. Ooh, Laura Mercier, uh, matte radiance baked powder highlight 01. I am pushing the edges here on this. I think that is everything I need. I think that's it. That's everything. Oh, I know what I forgot. The Pericone MD No Bronzer Bronzer, just in case. And that is everything. Let's see if it zips. It zips up. That's what's going with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please let me know if you have any questions. Just keep in mind that what you are seeing is for a very long period of time. This is not for a short period of time and I like to have a lot of options. So uh, onto what I'm wearing. Face is Giorgio Armani Lasting Silk, which is a little bit too light for me with a little bit of the 5.5 Luminous Silk. And the Lasting Silk is in the number six. NARS Radiant, Conce Radiant Creamy Concealer under my eyes. Laura Mercier Powder to set the Tarte CC Corrector. Chanel Loose Powder, ooh, Laura Mercier Cream Bronzer, the Makeup Forever Aqua or Cream Blush, the NARS Outlaw Blush, Guerlain Meteorites all over, but there's no um, highlighter. On my lids is a hodgepodge of things. I've got that NARS Pro Primer on it and the Anastasia Brow Wiz, but on my lids, it's that Urban Decay Easy Baked and like a bunch of other things like Laura Mercier Baroque, a MAC Shadow, and some Makeup Geek Shadows. 
um, La Mercier Pan Liner up on my waterline and the YSL Gloss Number no. 6 on my lips. Tallulah, Sell and Dot Tallulah Bib. This is being discontinued and it's on super sale or it was, if you can still get it. I'll link it below. Everything else is the same. Oh, I've got on my uh, Caddy Wrap. Uh, I don't have anything on this wrist. Oh, the shirt is from uh, White House Black Market and I need to brush my hair out. That's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please let me know if you have any other questions and thanks so much for watching as always. Bye.